All right, so here we go, guys. The Red Wings are indeed capitalizing on some of the picks that they acquired via trade. So take a look at this. This is a collection of two guys taken by the Wings. First off, apologies, because I did miss out on this one, the one you're seeing on your screen right now, because... Again, faulty recording equipment. It caused me to pause everything up, so we're moving these two together. The new prospects in the Red Wing system are Jan Bednar, a goaltender out of the Czech Republic, and Alex Cotton, an aggressive right-handed defenseman who scores a heck of a ton of points in the WHL. Let's go over to Jan Bednar's profile first and foremost. He is a guy who is born in August of 2002. Drafted 107th by the Red Wings. This was acquired in a trade with the Edmonton Oilers. This was Kyle Brodziak, Mike Green. Remember Mike Green? Yeah, he got traded over, and that was the pick they got in return. Jan Bednar, you can see he was drafted 107th, and he was projected to go in this range as well. Elite prospects had him at 102, future considerations 155, McKean's 135, 71st by TSN and Bob McKenzie, and he was the second-ranked European goaltender by NHL Central Scouting, obviously behind Yaroslav Askarov. So, he is a guy, six foot four, 196 pounds, out of Carlo Iveri in the Czech Republic. But what you'll notice first and foremost is that some of these numbers aren't pretty. The guy got... A 4.39 goals against average and an 8.84 save percentage in the Karla Viveri system this most previous season, but that's the full-on pro Czech league. So as a guy who was a teenager playing against men, you know, it's sort of forgivable if you take a look at that in that lens. However, this season, though, with the Czech U20 team, he's at a 9.58 save percentage and a 1 goals against average in one game. Obviously, one game, small sample size, whatever, but he is going over to the Akedi Baturs Titan in the QMJHL, so we'll see what he is able to do in North America once he comes over here. However, as the guy who was the number one, or excuse me, the number two European goaltender behind Askarov, though, there certainly is some value in picking up a guy like this, especially in the fourth round. So what this does is it gives the Red Wings a lot more competition in net in terms of their overall prospect pool. We've noted how they have a few goaltending prospects who do have some notable capabilities, but Jan Bednar, second best goaltender in Europe from the NHL Central Scouting Services, they definitely have him high up there too, so he is definitely going to challenge for some competition over there. Take a look at some of the scouting report data over here athleticism raw toolkit it's among the best in the class he's got himself a talent skill set that we have and we'll see how good that is able to translate as he goes over into the QMJHL next up though it's Alex Cotton a guy drafted by the Red Wings if we reload the page over here this was 132nd overall in the fifth round. This draft pick was actually acquired from the Minnesota Wild. It was a two-for-one swap here. The Wild essentially traded Damon Hunt in exchange for the two picks. Emil Vero we already spoke about. Alex Cotton is another guy over here for the Wings. And if you take a look at Alex Cotton, you take a look at the profile, he is a big right-handed defenseman. He is six foot two. 183 pounds, 19 years old, May 2001 birthday, so he is indeed a little bit older, but as an overager, he still does have a projectable somewhat skill set. He absolutely, ex absolute, absolutely, he absolutely exploded this past season with points, 67 points in 63 games played for the Hurricanes, 20 goals too. The guy's got really good offensive abilities, but he did just play very aggressively this most previous season, which is kind of how he was able to get so many points. Taking a look at the scouting report, though, this is on lastwordonsports.com. It notes how some of the best skills that he does have indeed revolve around the offensive zone and his offensive skills in general. However, he will need to improve himself defensively, defensive skill set, work in progress, difficulties with lateral movement, and strength on his skates. We also have a few more other things, though. Skating could use some work. If you go over to the projection, he has offensive skill, and pretty much that's what you're getting here. You got to develop this guy a little bit more, but when it comes to what he is good at, he is darn good at throwing the puck to the goal, setting guys up in front. He has poise with the puck on his stick and anticipates well where teammates are moving. Obviously, for the Lethbridge Hurricanes, he was very, very good for them, so we'll see how that translates next year as he plays another over-Asia year in the WHL, but he is indeed the newest Detroit Red Wing to be added into the system. So talk to me in the comments what you think about these two players, Jan Bednar, the 
second best goalie behind Askarov, and Alex Cotton, a brand new Detroit Red Wings right-handed D-man who can absolutely score some points. Talk to me in the comments if you think I hope you enjoyed this video. Sure that I trust in the I and I. And bye.